Hi, everybody. First of all, I would like to thank you, but a big thank you to all of you who are here, to all of you who have believed in us since the beginning, to all of you who started with collecting signature and then started with postering and then our membership grew so much so that now we have a wonderful group engaged. Thank you very much from the bottom of my heart because otherwise this wouldn't have been possible. First of all, I know we are really not a traditional party. We are radical, we are progressive, we are international, but mainly we have the freedom and the courage to stand for our values no matter what. We strongly believe that uh, the course of events can be reversed and that we are on the right side. Today, it's not only a celebration, but it's a call for a fight because the events uh, since the last seven months in Germany have left us all speechless. Nobody could expect what would have happened, but this helped us grow a lot. So now Germany not only is, not, is uh, economically declining, but also um, turning to author authoritarianism. Basic democratic de values that we had taken for granted are under threat. What is happening right now is that politicians are trying to, to scare us uh, until our hearts. They are trying to use fear in order for us to be scared and not to see what they are doing or what they are not doing because their poor politics are dragging us into a real bad, bad path. We, on the contrary, we are small, but I am very proud that we have a huge team, not only here, but internationally. We have also one of the most famous economists in the world, which makes us very proud, obviously. But um, we are not a protest party. Well, we do protest a lot lately, but um, our real force resides in our ideas, in our values. That today we are trying to explain, although our program is very, very broad, we wouldn't have the time to cover everything, but we will try it at least. The fil rouge of our campaign is the conviction that we need to redefine and rediscover what freedom means. Because freedom is a term that has been twisted a lot and it needs to be defined on different levels. For example, we have independence, so freedom as independence. At a personal level, it means that we, are, we have to be able to sustain ourselves to have, in order to, be, to live a dignified life. And for this, we have a universal, a universal basic income, for example. Because everybody has the right to choose and not to be obliged to take bad jobs or to choose whether to have a family or not. Nobody should be also be hindered from pursuing their passions. There is no freedom anyway. If we live in a society where um, oligarchs and uh, multinationals are influencing greatly um, our jobs, institutions, and the environment. Because obviously, um, freedom means also having the right to live in a safe planet, in a healthy planet, to eat healthy food, without going bankrupt, obviously. So what we are pushing is also a green transition that really uh, focus on investing on green jobs, on reconstructing our ecosystem, and obviously on sustainability in general. Because uh, we are really setting fire to our planet right now. And who are we to destroy this planet? Seriously. Who do we think we are? But in all this, there are different levels of responsibility. We have to acknowledge that. Because those who are polluting the most are those who are destroying the most. So that's why we want them to pay for all this. And uh, one last main point that I would like to make, and that obviously uh, unites us all since uh, seven months especially, is that we need freedom from war and freedom from fear. We have the right to live in peace. We have the right 
to move across countries freely. We have the right to seek for better chances in life. We really need to abandon the logic of competition and embracing solidarity at every level because we were all born with equal rights and as equal shall we live. So in short, we want people to live in respect, in, with dignity, in peace, in a healthy environment, because freedom equals freedom for all. And none of us is free until all of us are free. Thank you very much. <laughs>